Hello everyone and welcome back to another luxury home tour with your host, JP. Today we are in the beautiful city of Los Angeles about to tour this amazing architectural modern home. The property that we will be touring today features four bedrooms, six bathrooms, just over 5,700 square feet of interior space and it is currently on the market for just under $8 million. I also want to say a big thank you to the listing agent for letting us tour his amazing listing. You can find all of his information in the description down below. Also, don't forget to like and subscribe and comment down below and let's get started. architectural property features three stories. Only the first level is visible from the street level and on that floor we have access to the two-car garage space and the master bedroom. On the second floor that is going to be the main level where we have the kitchen space and some additional living areas. On the third and final floor we have access to three of the bedrooms and we have the beautiful infinity pool space. All right now let's begin our tour on the exterior of this incredible modern mansion. On my right hand side we have this driveway taking us up to the two car garage space. We also see the use of some rustic style panels on the right hand side of the garage space. And as we move through we have a continuation of that rustic metal on this side of the garage space. Let's continue down this stone pathway. Really cool detail, you actually have some additional lighting on the walkway of this property as you walk down the steps. On my right hand side we have the privacy windows taking us into the two car garage space. We have this massive floor to ceiling glass pivot door and let's head inside. Now we have just made it inside of this amazing architectural modern home. Directly walking in above the doorway, we have these clear story windows which bring in so much natural light to the entryway. And as we first walk in, we have this amazing art piece. Now this art piece is actually a completely carved out map of the entire city of Los Angeles. It actually is styled in the same rustic styled metal that we saw over on the exterior of the home. Moving through, on my left hand side, we have a built in coat hanger. And as we continue through, we have this frosted privacy floor to ceiling glass door and we are directly led into the master suite. We have so much natural light coming in from all these floor to ceiling windows covering the entire side of the wall here inside of this master suite. And we have some additional clear story windows bringing in some more natural light to this room. Now before checking out the bathroom, we actually have these Fleetwood sliding doors which take you out to an ensuite balcony. Let's go ahead and take a look inside of here really quickly. We have this triangular design right over here, and we have these modern glass panels separating this area, offering tremendous views of the entire city of Los Angeles. We also have some shelving right over here, perfect spot to hold your plants. Now let's continue back inside of this area. And right here we have this mounted flat screen TV, so you can watch TV with a view in the background. Super cool. Now let's continue on through right here. We have a very open concept master suite because we are directly led into the master bathroom space. We have this freestanding tub directly in front of this amazing floor to ceiling picture window, again of the entire city of Los Angeles. We actually see some more of the rustic styled metal details upon the exterior of this area and we have some built in wooden planks right over here. On my left hand side we have your floating vanity setup, two sinks inside of this area and we have your mounted mirror right above that. And continuing through on this side of the master bathroom, we have your walk in glass enclosed shower space, you have your mounted raid head right above this area and you got your built in body sprays. Now let's move on through right here. We have some more of the privacy window right over here. This actually takes you over into your water closet and you actually have a built-in bidet and this toilet is motion censored. So when you walk up to it, it actually opens up. Really cool. We have the same water closet on the other side and here we have the master closet space. We are surrounded with seamlessly integrated floor to ceiling storage right over here. You can go ahead and open these up. Again, really nice, sleek, modern interior. And on the left side of this master closet, we have some additional floor to ceiling floating shelving. Really nice. Now let's continue on through right over here. Again, we have all this natural light coming into the entry. Some more clear story windows on this side. And on my right hand side, this is where we have the two car garage space right over here. You have the frosted windows across this entire garage space offering plenty of privacy, but still lets in natural light. Now let's continue through down right this way. This is where we have your elevator space taking you down to floor number two and to floor number three. Moving through, we have your floating wooden staircase. We have this incredible floor to ceiling picture window looking out to the amazing foliage and letting in so much natural light. And follow me down these stairs and let's go ahead and check out floor number two, which is the main floor. Now we've just made it down to the second floor, which is the main living space. On my right hand side, this is where we have your elevator access. And on my left, we actually have these fixed glass panels on this side of the floating staircase. Now follow me right this way. And this is where we have your informal living room. I really like the details on the walls because they actually have a nice intricate wooden design across the entire living space. 
and moving through, we actually have some floor to ceiling wine bottle storage right here, completely temperature controlled and offering plenty of space for all the owner's favorite bottles of wine. Now let's move on through right here. We have space for your flat screen TV and continuing through right over here, this is where we have your powder room. We have a similar privacy door to the one that we saw over at the master suite and we have this tile design surrounding the entire area and some of the tiles are actually 3D. Really nice detail. We have space for your sink right over here. Now let's continue outside of the powder room. We have a built-in track lighting across the entire living space and this is where we have your informal dining table. Amazing modern light fixture hanging right above that dining table complemented with this artistic wall. Now moving through, we have your kitchen. Very nice, sleek, minimalistic stone design across the entire countertop. And we have the extended breakfast bar area, currently shown to sit up to two of your guests. And this material is actually a nice wood. Nice, tasteful hanging light fixtures right above this area. And we have all this seamlessly integrated cabinetry right here. We have a Gaggano refrigerator right over here. Nice stainless steel design. We can open this up. Nice, clean, modern interior inside of that refrigerator. Right next to that, we have your Gagano design oven setups right over here. Moving through, we have some more of that custom wooden cabinetry across the entire kitchen space. On my left-hand side, we have your built-in Gagano cooktop. We have the stainless steel pot filler, and right above that, we have your hood. Now, it's really cool because you actually have the exact same material that we see on the countertop double as the backsplash, offering a nice, clean, minimalistic feel inside of this kitchen space. On my right-hand side, this is where we have space for your integrated Wolf Design microwave space. On my left, we have a built-in sink setup. And we actually have some lift to open cabinetry spaces. It can actually press a quick button right over here and those will automatically close for you. Super cool feature. Right off from the kitchen, we are led into another nice seating space. On my right hand side, we have another picture window looking out to the foliage. We have all this natural light coming in from all these floor to ceiling windows looking out to the amazing city of Los Angeles. Moving through, we have a nicely integrated fireplace and we also have some additional metal details right above that, giving a nice artistic look. As we move on through, we have yet another formal seating space right over here. Again, a nice, clean, minimalistic design. On my left, we'll see some more of those beautiful stone details. Hanging light fixture right over here. And we are led out to the formal dining area. This dining table is currently shown to sit up to eight of your guests. You have a nice light fixture hanging right above that dining table. And as we move on through, we actually have a seamless indoor-outdoor flow directly out to the terrace. Let's go ahead and take a look. Now, I've just slid these Fleetwood doors all the way back, and we have that seamless indoor-outdoor flow to this amazing terrace space. We have some more of those metal details that we saw over on the exterior of the home, and we have those tremendous Los Angeles views. And you can actually look down at your infinity pool. Super nice view up here. Great space to relax with your friends, family, or just get some nice work done. Moving through, we can see some more of the exterior details. Again, like I mentioned earlier, we see some more of the rustic style panels. Moving through, we actually have a nice fire pit design right over here, right under this covering. And we have some more of the nicely detailed stone designs over on this side. Let's move on through again, a nice seating space, some more of the modern glass panels across this entire area. And another interesting detail is that you can actually access the third floor from this outdoor stair set, taking you directly down to the pool. We've just checked out floors number one and two, follow us right downstairs and let's go ahead and check out the third and final floor. Now we have just made it down to the third and final floor of this property. On my left hand side, we have an industrial concrete styled wall and to the right hand side of me, this is where we have your elevator space. Now follow me right down this way over to my right hand side and we are directly led into bedroom number two. So we have all this natural light pouring into this room, amazing picture window, again, looking out to that modern and Zen foliage. And another interesting detail about this bedroom is that you have all this seamlessly integrated closet storage, floor to ceiling, absolutely plenty of space, and you have these push to open pull out drawers right here, a really great feature. Now this bedroom is not en suite, but we actually have the bathroom located directly across from this room. So let's go ahead and check that out. We have a nice floating vanity design inside of this bathroom space. We have the mounted mirror right above, and this mirror actually doubles as some medicine cabinetry. Super cool detail, and you have some ambient lighting displayed right above this side of the ceiling. You've got your glass enclosed walk-in shower space right here, integrated shelving inside of there, and you have your ceiling mounted rain head inside of that shower space. Again, the use of the nice gray tiles, really nice, clean, modern design. Really love that. And directly next to this room, we actually have the laundry room. So let's go ahead and take a look inside of here really quickly. You have space for up to two appliances inside of this laundry room, plenty of that seamlessly integrated cabinetry, and you have your very own built-in sink. Now let's continue down the hallway. Follow me right this way. We're gonna go ahead and take a right-hand turn, and we are led into another amazing informal seating area. 
all this natural light coming in from bedrooms three and four, which we will check out in just a second. Like I mentioned earlier, we also have that amazing concrete slab wall on this entire side of the wall, giving a nice industrial modern feel. And right over here, we actually have some built-in shelving spaces. Really cool detail, all these shelving spaces are actually floating off the ground. Right below the shelving, we also see some more of that concrete slab design, and we have a built-in mirror displayed right below that. Really interesting because this mirror actually extends all the way over into bedroom number three, along with that floating shelving. So follow me right in here, let's go ahead and check it out. Another interesting feature I want to talk about is that the door that you have to this bedroom space. So it actually is a floor to ceiling glass door and you have the privacy frosted glass on this side, but you have the clear glass right below that. Really cool. Now let's check it out inside of here. Again, plenty of natural light coming into bedroom number three from those Fleetwood sliding doors, taking us out to the backyard space. And like I mentioned earlier, we have all this floating shelving spaces continuing into bedroom number three. Now let's move on through because bedroom number three is also en suite. Let's go ahead and take a look inside of here. So as seen in the last bathroom, again, we have that floating vanity setup and the mirror that doubles as a medicine cabinet. We also have your glass enclosed walk-in shower, again, the ceiling mountain rain head and some built-in shelving inside of there. Now let's continue outside of bedroom number three. Follow me right this way. And let's continue down right over here. Again, at the last bedroom that we saw, we also had that floor to ceiling glass door. Again, we have the same one taking us into bedroom number four. Inside of bedroom number four, we have all this natural light coming in, again, from those Fleetwood sliding doors, looking out to the beautiful city of Los Angeles. A very spacious bedroom because you actually have space for an additional seating area on this side of the bedroom. And follow me right inside of here. You have your full size walk-in closet space, all the built-in shelving spaces and these push to open drawers as well. Really great details. Again, floor to ceiling storage, plenty of space. Now moving through, we have an ensuite bathroom right here. Again, we have the same floating vanity setup that we saw in the last bedroom. And we have your glass enclosed walk-in shower space with that ceiling mounted rain head. And we have the integrated shelving inside of there too. Now let's move on through right here. Again, like I mentioned, all this natural light coming in. It's so beautiful. And we've just checked out the entire third floor. And now, let's go and check out the backyard. Now from this bedroom, we have that seamless indoor-outdoor flow out here to this incredible backyard space. Right in front of me, we have a built-in fire pit, a great opportunity for the owner to invite all the guests over. Let's continue on right down this stone pathway. Nice seating area staged on my right hand side. And on my left, we have the jacuzzi space, which is adjacent to your 30 foot infinity pool. We'll look at that in just a second. We'll follow me right down this way. This is where we have access over into bedroom number three. We have a nice little turf area right here. And we actually have the stair set, which takes us back up to the main level, the second floor. Now follow me back down right this way. And we have that tremendous 30 foot infinity pool. Absolutely amazing seamless design. You have these staged pool chairs offering such an amazing space to relax, hang out with some friends. And you have those sweeping views of the entire city of Los Angeles. You can actually see the ocean in the distance as well. So beautiful. Now moving through this stone pathway, we have your built-in barbecue setup right here. It actually is floating off the ground. Again, offering a nice and modern design. And as we move on through, we see some more of the floor to ceiling glass panels right over here, leading us in to the outdoor shower space. We have the fixed rain head displayed right above that. And moving through, we actually have a pool bathroom right inside of here. You have space for your sink right over here. And we see some more of the nice dark gray tiles that we have seen throughout the rest of the bathroom spaces. Now let's continue outside of the pool bathroom. Again, those absolutely tremendous Los Angeles city views. If you sticked around to the end of this video, I wanted to say thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please don't forget to like, subscribe, comment down below, hit that notification bell if you haven't already, and I will see you all in the next tour.